Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Who creates federal courts? The creation of federal courts in the United States is a process rooted in the U.S. Constitution and involves both the legislative and executive branches of the federal government. Constitutional basis. The U.S. Constitution, specifically Article III, establishes the foundation for the federal court system. It vests the judicial power of the United States in one Supreme Court and authorizes Congress to create lower federal courts. Role of Congress. Congress has significant discretion in determining the structure and jurisdiction of the federal courts. It is empowered to establish courts inferior to the Supreme Court, such as the district courts and courts of appeals. Congress has used this authority to create the current three-tiered system of federal courts, the 94 district courts, 13 courts of appeals, and the Supreme Court. Establishment of specific courts. Congress has periodically exercised its power to create different federal tribunals to adjudicate various legal disputes. For example, the Judiciary Act of 1789 and subsequent legislation have shaped the current federal court system, including the establishment of judicial districts and the three-tiered structure of the judicial branch. Appointment of judges. The judges who serve on these federal courts are appointed by the president and confirmed by the Senate. This process applies to judges on the district courts, courts of appeals, and the Supreme Court. The president nominates candidates and the Senate provides advice and consent before the nominees can take office. Jurisdiction and powers. Congress also determines the jurisdiction of the federal courts, including the types of cases they can hear. Federal courts have the sole power to interpret federal laws, determine their constitutionality, and apply them to individual cases. The Supreme Court has original jurisdiction over certain types of cases, such as those involving ambassadors and disputes between states. Life tenure and protections. Judges on these federal courts hold their offices during good behavior, which has been interpreted to mean life tenure subject only to removal by impeachment. Their compensation cannot be diminished during their time in office, ensuring their independence from political pressures. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.